Hello everyone, welcome back to Rush to Complete. Today we are playing Christmas Wonderland 2. Now we beat Christmas Wonderland 1 about a week ago. Um, this might be the last one for the Christmas Wonderland series that I play this year. I'm not entirely sure yet. We're going to be playing it on casual. This seems to have a similar build to how Halloween Trick or Treat went. Challenge mode is just, it's just not really, I mean, why bother with the challenge mode of it, you know? Like it's... No sparkles? I mean, it just makes the game... Like, it's not like it's a different game or anything. The difficulty goes up just because it takes take me more time to complete the level. So we'll just play it on casual. Let's see. So they're making a letter, sending it to Santa Claus. Last time we left Santa Claus, he was hiding gifts like the Easter Bunny. Um, breaking into people's houses who had... Or toy stores who had complicated locks. And among other things. So let's see if Santa has kind of redeemed himself, huh? It's Christmas time again, and it looks like all the children's letters have arrived. Wow, look at all these mail sacks. Okay. Find the hidden Santa toy and candy canes in every scene for bonus levels. Yeah, so it's, it's a similar thing to Halloween Trick or Treat. Um, lots of lights going on. Okay, so Santa toy. They're meaning literally a Santa toy. Okay. Similar, got a nativity scene it looks like we have to find overall. And then candy canes in this one, they've realized that it's just better to just make them a findable um, object on the map. I don't know if it'll come up and tell us that we have found all of them, um, like it does in Halloween Trick or Treat. I don't think it matters if you do find all of them, so I don't know if we'll spend a lot of time looking for them. Let's... I mean, it still hasn't said we found all of them yet. That was three. So, hmm, let's get to work on this. We got penguin, windmill. There's a windmill over there. Got some moving parts on this map now. You got Santa Claus moving. You got a, I think that wants to be a reindeer, but I'm pretty sure that's a moose. Penguin and cherries. Huh. Penguin... And cherries. It's funny, I don't see a penguin anywhere. Cherries right there. Kind of looks like holly, depending on how you look at it. Bowling ball and a penguin. Penguin and a bowling ball. There's a swan up here. Do we need swans again? Penguin. Bowling ball, owl, and pink ribbon. Okay. Bowling ball. And again, like before... We'll try to not use a hint until we get into the, uh, like, final three, just to make it go by faster once we've already given the level a very serious look through. I'm um, surprised I don't see another candy cane. Um, I keep thinking this is a candy cane, but that's 100% a toothbrush. I don't recommend brushing your teeth with a candy cane. <laughs> uh, kind of defeats the whole purpose. Um, pink ribbon. I don't see a pink ribbon at all. Maybe that's... Pink ribbon, eggs, lollipops, all the lollipops. Skateboard. Eggs. Skateboard. Pink ribbon and a dartboard. Dartboard. Skateboard, pink ribbon, two snowshoes. I'm not entirely sure what a snowshoe looks like. These? Okay. Um, there's some, like, is that, what is that? <laughs> Ski, a dog. Dog, a very simple dog. I mean, those are kind of snowshoes, if you think about it. I wouldn't recommend riding, or walking on the snow with them, but you could ride them on ice. If the ice is thick enough. Uh, pencil. <laughs> Kite. Snowshoe. And a pink ribbon. I think this is where... I wish I could have at least found the pink ribbon. Because if you can find one of them, you're going to be able to use a hint. <sighs> Looks like a badminton racket. Like, right here. That's my point. There's one right here. How do I know that's not a snowshoe? I can't see the bottom part of it. Hmm. I feel like we've been playing a lot of casual art games recently. <laughs> Uh, there it is, pink ribbon. Well, that cat is very well hidden. I, said, I don't know if they're going to t 
tell us if we found all the Santa toys? The other problem is, is that it's, it's just Santa toys that we're looking for. The map of where I live with Mrs. Claus and the elves is all mixed up. See if you can help me put it back together. You have a... Oh, that is really slow. Wow, that is... Oh, that is dreadfully slow. This game was made after one, right? This just feels so slow. This is what happens when you realize that you only put 12 pieces on it. So you're like, I got the best way to prolong this. Okay, it doesn't even turn the other way, so you can't even make this go faster just by turning it the other way. Wow. Whew. Okay. Ah, the mail room is messy as usual. Let's pick up a few things, then we can sort out the letters from all the boys and girls. Uh, you know, it's a good thing. Oh, find all the parts of the nativity scene scattered. So, that's an angel? Okay, so yeah. So these key ones are going to be found through um, the actual items. The Santa Claus toys. So there could be more than one Santa Claus toy. That might be the problem. Or no, that was the first one. I found a candy cane first. Right. Um, candy canes. I don't see any. Oh, there's one. So they're not just going to tell you? Or they're just going to... Is it so one and three then? Or can it change? Why is this not considered one? Okay, let's get to work. So key, a piggy bank, and a maracas. So piggy bank. Clown, that's weird. Didn't even know we needed that. Key, maracas, Santa's hat. Santa's hat, very simple. Bell, I mean, that's a bell. You gotta, you gotta define it. Are we talking a shaking bell? Are we talking like a, you know, a bell that shakes itself? <laughs> Candy. Bells. Gold baubles. Let me know if I'm saying that wrong in the comments section. I've now said that wrong for probably four videos. But I don't care. I'm still not, I'm still gonna say it the same way, probably. But hey, let me know if I'm saying it wrong. It'd be interesting to know how to properly say that. Egyptian statue, a starfish, starfish, maracas, there's maracas, maracas, so candy, bells, and a starfish. Two of those I'd expect to be found at Santa's workshop, the other one, no, not even slightly, um, candy, bells, bells. Okay, candy. Problem is, like, we found three candy canes. Would that count? That's ice cream. That's a treat. There are candy app or candy oranges, and there are candy pretzels. I mean, we have like, we have cinnamon sugar pretzels. Oh, they looked like presents. That's cheating. <laughs> you can't do it like that. I mean, come on. <sighs> Find it, games. Every year I get a ma every year I get mail from all over the world. I'm still reading as if this game was Christmasville. Can you match up the countries? Okay, what we got here. We got Italy. Oh. Okay, China. Okay. Is that Seattle? That's Canada. It's Ottawa. Okay, that's... Is that Brazil? We got a Brazil in here? We do have a Brazil. Nice. There we go. Okay, that's Rome. So, Italy. Paris. Um, America. What other... That's a kangaroo, right? Why does it look, why does it look like snow in the background? That's Aussie. Why does that look like that? Weird. Okay. No Japan, man. That's weird. Look at all the toys outside the workshop. The elves must have been really busy today. Well, hey, at least you're 
at your workshop and not stealing from another area. Small baby steps. Uh, here we go. Santa. Is that a shepherd? Yes. We need to find a Santa toy and we need to find three candy canes. I think that's... That's the first candy cane? Oh, wow. There's a candy cane. There's a candy cane. I don't see the Santa toy. Uh, Santa toy. There it is. Okay. Paw print, ice cream, dove. I'm not talking about the soap. Gum boot. A boot made of gum? What are we talking about here? What what is this? Like are we talking like gum stuck to a boot? A rabbit? It's funny, I just saw a squirrel and thought, ah oh, yes, a rabbit. That is very good. Where was the squirrel I saw? Right there. There it is. A glider. Oh, it's a kite, I guess. I mean Define the difference. <laughs> Uh, teddy bear, teddy bear, teddy bear, teddy bear. Okay, that's hilarious. Teddy bear, woodpecker. I have a lot of woodpeckers. Woodpecker. Gum boot. What is that? Paw print, ice cream. Ice cream, paw print. Excellent. Paw print, ice cream. They need ice cream, an RC car, a seahorse. RC car and a seahorse. Stop it. I wonder how long it would take to go through this entire game exclusively using the hint button. <laughs> I'm just going to click that before it goes away. Is that a seahorse? Sweet. A uh, glider. Is that a glider? No. That's gliding. Um... Huh. A glider and a gum boot. Really would just love to know. Is that a gum boot? Whoa. Okay, it's a gum boot. I I clicked on that? I know I clicked on that. That is wrong. I clicked on that. I want my hint back. It didn't do anything anyways, but there seem to have been some changes since this. There seem to have been some changes since this I was here this morning. Can you spot them? I'm not going to comment. Um, okay. That's just kind of weird how once you start having to read these, like, the stories out loud, you get to a point where you're like, wow. There's a lot of, like, missteps in the grammar on these games. Doesn't make the games bad, it just kind of is funny. You don't notice that until you actually have to slow yourself down and read it. And then you're like, oh wow, my brain does a lot of autocorrect. <laughs> Gee whiz, the children are going to love these toys. Wow, this is a very... A lot of less talking from Santa in Christmas Wonderland, too. I mean, Christmasville, the whole thing was just talking nonstop. But now it's like, we're just going to get right to the toys. You can definitely say it's an improvement from Christmas Wonderland 1, where it just kind of felt like I was going around to random places and taking their stuff. Uh, okay, that's not another candy cane. Okay, so we have a cello, a crocodile, and socks. Every kid's dream. Socks and a cello. Is that a cello? What is a cello? Is that a string instrument? Mm, oh. Well, oh. proof that there is more than three candy canes per level. That stinks. <laughs> so now I care even less about finding all of them. Um, is that a cello? No, it's a, that's got to be a saxophone. Didn't stop me from clicking on it, though, but... Cello, crocodile, crocodile. It could be an alligator, though. Juggle, juggling baton. Well, these kids want some very weird toys. <laughs> Acorn, spinning top, manger. 
thought that's what that was. But I guess I'm wrong. I Honestly, I haven't been able to find any on it. There's a cello. It's a string instrument. Okay. Socks. Football. I'm talking to, you know, actual football? American football. Okay. Glasses. Shamrock. Manger. Spinning top. Spinning top. I that was so large and just completely just not proportionate to how big a spinning top is usually in these games. That was just there's no way that's what that is. Juggling baton, a dime. Dime. Is it a skipping rope? Isn't that supposed to be a jump rope? What's a skipping rope? I'm learning new things by playing these games. <laughs> um, I don't know if any of them are things I should be learning, but learning nonetheless. Okay, juggling baton. I mean, a pencil the size of a baton counts, right? Oh, that was, that's a juggling baton. Okay, you're talking like a juggler's. Okay. Okay. Socks. Oh, so when you're talking the manger, you're talking the whole nativity scene. Wow. Kind of feel like that should have been in the last level, but... Who am I to judge? Socks. Socks. Right above the baton. Because I'm just blind to the color green. Good to know. Good job. Thank you. What do we got next, huh? It will be fun to put this airplane kit together. Then we can head off to the stables. Yeah. Well, I'm glad Santa hasn't lost his uh, overall joy of, you know, like all the other Santas, just not doing what he's supposed to be doing at the time. Such a kind of weird. Every single Christmas game has that, like, thing of, you know, Santa is busy, always working to get the toys ready for the kids, and then it's like, and here's the game based off Santa Claus, and watch as he does absolutely none of that. <laughs> Is there been a Christmas game where you just play a Santa making toys? Probably. Let me know and I'll play it. <laughs> the stables are looking pretty good. We'll pick up a few things, then check out the reindeer. Yeah, probably should. Uh, let's see here. Candy cane. We'll stick with, like, the three, and then if I see another one, I'll obviously just click on it, just so that I kind of do what they asked me to do for the extra stuff. Hello. You look terrifying. How you do? Huh. I don't see a third. There it is. Okay. So we have a football. Scroll. Okay. I scrolled. Now what? Um, you asked for it. Straw. I mean... I mean, like... Oh, you're talking like a, a drink straw. Okay. Be a little bit more specific. Hay and straw can be interchangeably used. <laughs> uh, sheep. One sheep there. Second sheep there. Spinning top, yin yang. Very interesting. Having seen as many Asian animations as I've seen, yin and yang have become a completely different meaning than what most people probably see it as. It's a very interesting... Very interesting belief. Kind of cool. Uh, shrimp? Garden fork. Yes, indeed. It's good they put that down and not just fork. Okay, I got the garden fork. Broccoli. Tambourine. Tambourine. Tangerine. Tambourine. What is that? I knew that was one of them. Skinning. Skinning. Spinning top. Golf. Flag. Golf. A golf. Huh? I found H. No. Only in the other game. Understandable. What is, what is this Christmas tree got in it? What? Broccoli. Oh, honestly, broccoli. Ah, oh, yeah, Santa's workshop. A place filled with sweets and broccoli. I haven't been able to see. I think there's the baseball. What is that? 
I honestly don't know what I'm looking at on this map. Uh, haven't been able to find the football. I might have to start clicking or doing the hints early just so we can get through this level. Because <laughs> I'm not picking up anything. Um, oh, there's Yin Yang. Okay, now if I can find a scroll or the football scroll. Okay, so to press the hint. I do. That's not fair. That doesn't count. If I if this will scroll down every time I try to click up there, that does not count as a place to put an object. <laughs> Come on. Be fair, okay? Tambourine and a golf flag. Problem is I have no idea what a golf flag looks like. Are we talking about the thing that likes in the you know, the hole until you take it out to putt? Is that what we're talking about? Tells you what hole you're on? Is there some other kind of... Let's just get the hint used, please. Let me use the hint. Wow. Okay. You know what's great when you use a hint and it covers up what you're trying to click on? I haven't been able to find anything on this. There it is. Jeez. Is it infuriating to watch Find It videos by people where you're sitting there like, I can see it. Some joker has put all the reindeer in the wrong stables. Guess we better put them back in the right place. Now this is just... This has got to be like... We, we did this in the other game, but they were doing it in a matching order. When you don't even bother to make it, make it a matching game, is that when you're just like... People just want to get to the actual game. They don't want to play this, like... You know, maybe 10 second uh, order game. <laughs> now it's time to fly to the shopping mall to visit my grotto. I need to put together this map of the world to plan my trip. Okay, click and drag the pieces. Okay, very simple, very simple puzzle. Okay, what is this, like a 5x4, so 20 piece puzzle. Okay, and somewhere over here, like that, like that, like that, like that, that, and that, and that. Did I accidentally put that piece where it was supposed to be, or did I actually aim that? Uh oh. Ah. <laughs> I think I made a comment in one of the last videos. I was like, yeah, when was the last time you saw something like that when you just accidentally put the piece on there and then the rest of the puzzle piece started going over? We got a cutscene. Okay, what do we got? Second cutscene of the game. So am I halfway through it already? That was quite the cutscene. These skyscrapers look familiar. Let's collect some things as we fly past, then we'll head for the mall. And Santa's off to steal once again. Okay, Santa. Going on your stealing ways, I see. Okay. Again, we'll try to get three of these and one of those. Okay. We'll use the Santa toys to kind of tell us what level we're actually on. Um, so we need a UFO. That's right there. We need a paper plane, an axe, a compass. Well, how are we supposed to see a compass on this? Is that a compass? No, it's a frying pan. Excellent. Satellite. Um, <laughs> camera just there. Is that a speaker? Another camera. What is this? Seems like they're doing it on purpose. Um, is that a satellite? Excellent. The letter X. Oh, that's a comp that's the compass, okay. So we're looking for the letter X. Candy cane. Um Maracas. Balloon. Safety pin. Helicopter. Penny penny whistle. What's a penny? 
Is that a penny whistle? Broncos. What's a penny whistle? I'm not even kidding. Somebody tell me in the comment section right now. <laughs> what is a penny whistle? Uh huh. They're making stuff up, I guarantee it. <laughs> um. Okay. Paper plane. Penny whistle? No. Get off the screen. Stop it. Penny whistle. Paper airplane. X. Okay. So penny whistle and a X. Somebody's got like Xmas somewhere? I mean, kind of an X. If you look at it sideways. Uh, X. It's probably some building thing. Is that an X? I mean, okay. Yeah. I knew it. I have no idea what a penny whistle is, and I can't even begin to imagine, like, what it would look like. Is it just a simple whistle? Is there something special about it? Is it shaped like a penny? I don't know how you do a whistle like that, but... I don't make these things. What the heck was that? <laughs> okay, we'll do one more level. Alright, we can sneak in through that door, but first we should tidy up some of the stuff that got skated around when we landed. Messing stuff up. Sneaking into buildings when they're not even open. Nope, Santa has not reformed. He is the same Santa as I remember him. Ah, <sighs> Santa, what have you... What what has happened to you? Okay, we're looking for the wise men. Um, are they all going to be together? Nope. Nope. This one's way slower for its levels. Is there way more levels in this one? Okay, so... Looking for an American football. A lobster. Because what else would you expect to find on the top of a roof? There's an X right here. This one's way easier to find. I found it. Hey, I found it. It has been found. American football. Guitar, grapes, and a rocket. That's a space shuttle, I guess. I still don't understand the difference. Guitar. That's a rocket. Guitar, grapes, and a bowling pin. Guitar, grapes, and a bowling pin. There's a bowling pin. Guitar, grapes, and a shoe. Number 10 is H2O. 10. Lobster, shovel, and a hook. Shovel. Lobster and a hook. We got a hook. A lobster, a shoe, grapes, lobster, shoe, and guitar. That dog looks like a meme. Lobster, shoe, and guitar. There's the guitar, a lobster, and a shoe. There's the lobster, a shoe, Kent. That, yeah, see, I wasn't considering that. I was thinking of a sneaker. Okay, everyone, I hope you're enjoying Christmas Wonderland 2. Next time we will be leaving off, or sorry, not <laughs> next time we'll be picking up right here where we left off. Hope you guys are enjoying December and the Christmas season. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.